Perhaps the most overused genre during the 8-bit era is the isometric maze game, first popularized with Ultimate's seminal Night Law on the Spectrum. If there is just one game of this genre you need to play, this is the obvious choice. A huge, sprawling game set over multiple worlds with excellent variation in background graphics, despite the obvious spectrum roots and OK sound. The slowdown which cripples most games of this type on the 64 is minimal and the overall speed of the game is much better than its contemporaries. You control two characters, head can jump high and glide whilst heals is faster and can carry objects. You have to complete the first area before you can unite the characters and then use their talents to get past the myriad of puzzles and find the five crowns or escape to freedom. This will keep you occupied for a long time as it's fiendishly difficult in places. This is perhaps the only game of this type where the 64 version is as good as the Spectrum game. Thumbs up!
The Amiga version is perfectly serviceable but makes no real use of the extra horsepower of the Amiga. It also released in 1991 when games had moved on considerably and was regarded as something of a relic on release. Still, it's a perfectly acceptable conversion.